This is cool. You interviewing me? There's good to have friends in high places. Yeah, I guess. So where's your application? Are you kidding? You want me to fill out that dumb application? Yeah, I do. I gotta have the paperwork. If we're hired, we'll need this process here. If I'm hired? Oh, I see. Let the higher up see that we you're doing this magic thing right. Well, yeah, there's that. But to interview for the job, I need to complete a job application. See your experiences and stuff like that. Dude, it's me. You already have everything you need to know. I'm waiting for you to tell me when to start. You haven't gotten the job yet. Hey, I thought it was a done deal. Derek, I told you there was an opening here on my ship. I told you to come in and apply for the job. I'll apply. I never said you had the job. There's like six people applying for this job. I can't just give it to you because I know you. Well, that's what usually what our friends for. Help each other out. Man, you know I need this gift. Then fill out an application and get interviewed like everyone else. The best person gets the job. I can't believe you're being such a jerk. This manager thing has really gone into your head. I'm just trying to do my job. They promoted me because I don't slack off. I'm responsible and I take this all very seriously. A little too seriously for me. This is a fast food place for crying out loud, not some bank on Wall Street. If it's only a fast food place, why do you want to work here so bad? Because I thought I could cut through all this crap because I have a connection. I thought my friend would help me in this time of need. Well, I'm not going to ha just hand this job to you, Derek. I worked really hard <coughs> to make shift manager. I'm not going to blow it by hiring someone who thinks he can screw around all day because he has to have a connection. Don't take advantage of me like that, man. Oh, I swear to uphold the company oath. Is that it? Thou shall not sneak french fries at break time. <laughs> Sorry, Derek, but it seems pretty obvious that you're definitely not cut out to work here. You're like a freaking robot. What does place do to you, man? Made me appreciate a harder dollar. Who are you? My dad? Oh. Thanks for stopping by, Derek. I wish you the best of luck. So that's it. You're dismissing me. Not gonna let me work in this crappy place because you happen to have too much integrity? It doesn't seem to be suited to you. I think you'd be happier working someplace else. This is unreal. You're a scary man. Every time you put on that uniform, you turn into someone I really don't want to know. You even talk different. I've got some other people to interview, so... Are there any cameras? Is this a Twilight Zone episode? If you fill out an application, I'll review it and get it back to you in a couple of weeks. Screw it! I don't need this job that much. I'd like to stay human, if you don't mind. See. <laughs>